Boya a doha I can yeah dog we are a yeah dog we can jockler so mao for do a jockly me share a cool Kakanachi <laughs> I mean, I told you Rachi <laughs> I feel my There are certain modern techniques needed to shape and bring innovation to the art that they lack. So, in their various homes, they weave according to the market demands. And then, what quality are we looking for? So, they also had lesson in quality control. There, they all had the awareness that they have been doing so many things wrong. Vous <laughs> O promi gere suku koma ado jujo na male gbegbe e mi ro suku koma a ale ike na ko de chiko ati avoi wa nya po o fia ala kamiza ni lo na vocha wa ku vo tutu le mo ala ba ala ba cha miza ni eru lo kumi ko ti na vo sempre sha lo akama ba ku e ti ba ateki avo they also come to open their eyes on marketing, not just to whip kente and sell in Abuzum, but the way they can go onto the internet, exploit the internet, that market over there to their advantage. If you go to the Kete market, you see so much error especially in the choice of color. Everything in the market, about 90% is yellow, yellow, yellow. And I ask myself, is it the customers that demand yellow, yellow, yellow? It is purely lack of knowledge. And today, these participants will tell you that they are informed about what to send to market from uh, henceforth. Color theory. Catafia <laughs> To have this 
association that has both male and females working together to grow their trade, to improve upon the, their skill set, to they've learned four different patterns and techniques from, from the consultants that we brought on board. They're learning diversification. You could even see the changes when you now have a discussion with them about their weaving. The, the way they talk about it has even changed versus previously in the beginning when we met them, they were just thinking of, okay, I'm weaving, I'm going to take it to the market and I'm going to sell and then I'm going to weave again. Mama there's something about being unique, being different. It appeals to a certain class of people. That There's beauty in being unique. There's beauty in, in, in diversity. Magbulangwa, <laughs> Yahovie, <laughs> And we heading to the next part, which will be how we uh, set up a center for them to develop and increase their living means through the skills that they've acquired during this first phase and special thanks to the consultants who were very helpful uh, during that.